Greetings to all my tech heads out there in the Kev Techify Nation. And if you're new here, welcome. In this episode, we're going to look at configuring IP addressing. We'll be discussing manual IP address configuration for the devices, automatic IP address configuration for end devices, and finally, switch virtual interface configuration. This episode is part of my series on introduction to networks. I'm Kevin here at Kev Techify. Let's get this adventure started. Hey, there are two methods to set your IP address. One's a manual way, and the other one is an automatic way using DHCP. Manual way, you go into your device and you type in your address. Here's an example of the Windows way of setting it. You go in here, you, you make sure you check this box, the box over here that says, use the following IP address, and then you go and you manually type this in. So you put your cursor here, you go to your keyboard, you type those numbers in. You do that for all three of those fields to set your IP address. Now to do it automatically, what we do is instead of checking that use obtain, use the following IP address, we go and we select this one, obtain an IP address automatically. What it, this is going to do is go out on your network, look for a DHCP server, a server that hands out IP addresses and configuration information and obtain that address that way. So our two methods here for setting an IP address in Windows is manually and automatically. Well, in the Cisco operating system, the two methods do exist. Primarily, we're always setting our IP address manually. You can do it automatically and get your address from an IP server out there, a DHCP server. But that's only in a very, very rare situation that you're going to do that because your networking devices, they're setting up the network. They're, they're, they're establishing that. So you want them to have a manual, you want them to have a static IP address. The set our IP address is here on a, in the Cisco operating system. Once again, we go from privilege exec mode into global configuration. And then we tell it what interface we want to configure that IP address in. So we're gonna go to the interface VLAN one here. Interface VLAN one, we type that in and notice our prompt changes. Now we're showing that we're configuring an interface. Now we want to put our IP address in there. First thing we do is we type in our command, IP address. Now we put a space in there, signifying that's the end of the command and we're going to start our argument. Now we're going to tell it we're going to put it in an address. So we put an address, then we put in the value here for our address, followed by a space. Then the next thing we have to put in there is that we have to put our subnet mask in. Once again, this is what we're setting up or we're doing this manually on our Cisco devices. You'll need to go into every interface that needs an IP address, set it up this way. But this is how we manually set up our IP addresses on a Cisco device. It was my pleasure to provide you with this wonderful episode on configuring IP addressing. If you like this episode and you got value out of it, and depending upon the platform you're using, please click that like button, give a five-star rating, leave a comment. This all helps me bring you more great content. Please take a minute to subscribe to my channel. All of my socials and contact information are on my website, kevtechify.com, and you can get all of these episodes in video and podcast form. In the upper right is my playlist for my series on introduction to networks. In the bottom right is one of my favorite videos that I linked just for you. Thank you so much for watching this episode on my series of introduction to networks. Once again, I'm Kevin. This is Kev Techify. I'll see you next time for another great adventure.